The Cajun Navy, remember them? A volunteer organization descends on the Carolinas to help those affected by Hurricane Florence. On the phone with us now is Sean Boudreau, Cajun Navy Relief President. Mm. Welcome back. Good to see you again, sir. How you doing? <laughs> Excellent. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. How many people you got drafted into the Carolinas? Oh, right now, our, our rosters just keep growing by the minute. Um, <laughs> as the situation evolves, we're keeping track of who's available, when and where. Uh, some people are taking interest in taking care of personal family first, but the rosters just keep growing. And, uh, you know, 80 was the last count we had uh, of people who were ready to be in action right now, but the number's going up to hundreds and hundreds. Now, I remember you were from Louisiana and Texas. Mm. Are you, have you got a convoy of some sort going from, from, the, uh, from the Louisiana and Texas over to the Carolinas? We do have some folks who are willing to take their personal equipment that far, which we do appreciate, but I think that the real strength of what we're trying to accomplish is to utilize local assets. Mm. People who live local to the disaster are able to help their neighbors, and that's the philosophy. That's what we want to embrace. Sounds uh, like so that it, way you don't have to. Well, it, it sounds like you're setting up almost a permanent operation, a permanent organization that springs into action when you've got this kind of, uh, of flooding or natural disaster. Of course. I mean, that's, that's, uh, you know, that's what it's about to help your neighbors. How many people have you rescued so far? Uh, right now, our numbers are uh, with Lumberton and the area that we're staged right now. We don't have as many rescues. We're doing some back end operations, some pathfinding, and trying to support ourselves for a large flood we know is headed mm. to areas that we've seen in the past. Other Cajun Navy groups that are out there have been on the coastline and right where it hit. I do know that they have been in action. I don't have numbers from them, but from where we are, uh, we're preparing for quite a flood, something unseen ever before. It sounds like almost a military operation that you're mounting here. It kind of is. It, it just really falls in line with that. And if you understand uh, incident command and how to respond to disaster, you can play within the framework that's used by FEMA and everybody else. doesn't mean we're trying to be FEMA. It means we're just trying to speak the same language and work with them. So you are expecting, you are making a plan for a major flood because this, uh, this hurricane is hovering over the Carolinas and is just dumping probably feet of rain. You're planning for that. Yes. Yeah. Yes, I and mean, we did the same in Hurricane Matthew in 2016. We headed to this area back then. Uh, and we, we're familiar with some of the area, and we know what happened at that time, and this is going to be more rainfall than then. So, I mean, it, the, the situation is dynamic. We'll see how it changes over time, but we do anticipate uh, it will be a flood-based situation. Uh, and you are supported by uh, charitable donations from individuals? You don't take any government money, nothing like that? No, sir, we're not interested in that. A lot of us are doing this out of the kindness of our hearts. You know, the charity that we're looking for would be to buy high water vehicles for the organization, but otherwise to support the people who are part of our organization as leaders that are, you know, taking their personal time and money to do this. I'll try and reimburse gas according to the federal standards, you know, as a nonprofit. We have rules that we have to follow by. But I want to do what I can to help these people operate, but we're not looking to make money on this. No, Nobody sir. gets paid in our organization. Got it. Sean Boudreau. Cajun Navy guy. Thanks for joining us, sir. I'm sure we'll see you again. Guaranteed. Thank, Thank you. you very much.